All right, now there are three main things on the agenda of the Aam Admi Party National Executive today. That's what we are going to we are breaking here on headlines today to discuss and decide on Arvind Kejriwal's offer of resignation as the national convener. Discuss and decide whether Yogendra Yadav and Prashant Bhushan should be recalled from the political affairs committee of the party. Reorganize and choose a new disciplinary committee which is currently headed by Bhushan and there have been serious allegations against Yadav and Bhushan leveled by Dilip Pandey in a written complaint. This will be probed by the disciplinary committee and hence it needs to be reorganized. Ankit Tyagi is now joining us with more details. Ankit, so far the attention or the focus of the national executive perhaps was on the fate of Prashant Bhushan and Yogendra Yadav. But now uh, this whole angle of Arvind Kejriwal wanting to resign as the national convener has been added. How is it going to change the equations at the national executive then? Well, one thing very sure, Maha, this uh, whole resignation uh, drama that has uh, now ensued uh, as far as the National Executive of the Ahmadi Party is concerned, one thing is sure, Arvind Kejriwal, this is going to be unanimously rejected. So once again, Arvind Kejriwal establishes himself as the supreme leader of the Ahmadi Party. Uh, on 26th, when the National Executive took place, he sent a message, not a resignation letter, a proper resignation letter. Uh, he sent a message uh, to the National Executive saying that he no longer wants to continue as the National Convener. On 27th night, Arvind Kejriwal uh, wrote this resignation letter. It was a handwritten letter and it has been delivered to Pankaj Gupta, the secretary of the Aam Aadmi Party yesterday night to be presented today. So first on the agenda would be the discussion on the national, uh, on the uh, of resignation of Arvind Kejriwal, mm -hmm. which sources are telling us will be unanimously uh, rejected. After that, uh, uh, after that, the on discussion would be the key point, uh, whether uh, uh, Prashant Bhushan and Yogendra Yadav should continue in the PAC. I would like to uh, make a, distinguish, a, disting, uh, a distinction here, uh, Maha, for the benefit of our viewers. Yogendra Yadav and Prashant Bhushan, as of now, cannot be expelled from the PAC okay. because the disciplinary committee can only take that charge. The national executive has sent them uh, uh, to the PAC, but they can be recalled. So the national executive today will decide whether Yogendra Yadav and Prashant Bhushan should be recalled. And of course, third of the agenda will be reorganization of the disciplinary committee, which as of now is being chaired by Prashant Bhushan. Since there are uh, serious allegations of uh, indulging in anti-party activity, in conspiracy against the national convener that has been leveled by Dilip Pandey, this uh, committee, a three-member committee will be reorganized. And then that business committee will probe whether Prashant Bhushan and uh, Yogendra Yadav can be expelled or not. Ankit, it appears that the, the reason of why Arvind Kejriwal is not attending the national executive today as earlier stated was uh, on the grounds of health that he's flying away to Bengaluru but that doesn't seem to be the only reason with his resignation uh, drama coming into play now is nobody taking exception to the fact that he's skipping the national executive? Well, uh, uh, what Arvind Kejriwal has done, and uh, many are calling it uh, very smartly, is that he has excused himself from the voting. There are 21 voting members, those who are going to decide on all these issues, including Arvind Kejriwal. Now, Arvind Kejriwal has said that since I have resigned and the national executive has to take, uh, uh, has to take uh, con into consideration his resignation, he is not going to vote. So, what he is trying to do is to take higher moral ground. Mm -hmm. uh, if the if Yogendra Yadav and uh, Prashant Bhushan, which is almost certain they will be recalled from the PAC, from the, uh, from the Political Affairs Committee. Arvind Kejriwal will go out and say he was not a part of that meeting because he had already resigned. So he has done two things. A, he has uh, uh, put pressure on the PAC. He is going to emerge as Supreme Leader and B, he will not take part in right. the decision when Yogendra Yadav and Prashant Bhushan are asked uh, to come back from the PAC. Very clever move there perhaps by Arvind Kejriwal. Many thanks uh, Ankit for joining us with details and getting us uh, those uh, exclusive bits about what to expect in the national executive.